Today we are learning about two-digit by two-digit multiplication. As a fifth grader, this can often cause confusion if we don't follow the steps correctly. It is important that we learn how to do math correctly so that we don't make mistakes as we are in the process as we are multiplying our numbers. When we look at a two-digit by two-digit multiplication problem, we often think it is too difficult and we want to give up. I am hoping that by working each step with you, that you will feel better about these problems. So let's get started. We are going to multiply 41 times 23. In step 1, the numbers that we are going to multiply are green. We are going to multiply 3 by 1. 3 times 1 equals 3. We will write the 3 under the green 3. In step 2, the numbers that we multiply are purple. So we will multiply 3 by 4, and the answer is 12. We will write the 12 next to the green 3. So far, we have multiplied 41 times 3, and the answer is 123. In step 3, notice that there is a 0 under the green 3. This is because we are multiplying by our tens digit in the lower number, or the 2 of the 23. The zero is a placeholder. Um, the numbers that we multiply in this step are blue. Two times one is two. We will write a two under the purple two and to the left of the zero. In step four, the numbers that we multiply are red. We are multiplying two times four. Two times four is eight. We will write the eight next to the blue two. We are done with multiplication in this problem. However, we are not done finding the answer. We have some addition to do. We need to add 123 plus 820 to find our final answer. So, in step 5, we will get our final answer. 3 plus 0 is 3. 2 plus 2 is 4. 1 plus 8 is 9. So our final answer is 943. Another way to say this is 41 t times 23 is 943, or the product of 41 times 23 is 943. I hope that watching this little tutorial has helped ease your mind about solving two-digit by two-digit multiplication problems and that you have much success with these problems. Good luck in solving two-digit by two-digit multiplication problems.